Are you looking for some inspiration for your next Raspberry Pi Pico project? Here are some cool projects we found just for you. So, picture this, you're sitting in your car, getting ready to head out, and you realize you forgot to close the garage door. No worries. With our project, you can control your garage door using your smartphone. How cool is that? Here's the scoop, we're using a clever setup with a Pico W, a tiny but powerful device. We're turning it into a smart controller for the garage door. No more dealing with clunky remotes or buttons. Here's how it works. We're setting up a web page on the Pico W that you can access from your phone. This web page has buttons for opening, stopping, and closing the garage door. All you need to do is tap on your phone screen, and voila! Your garage door listens and obeys. Imagine a mini Mars rover with a robotic arm that can move around and pick up objects. The rover is equipped with an FPV system that allows the user to see what the rover sees. The robotic arm is controlled by the user and can be used to pick up rocks or other objects on the surface of Mars. The arm is designed to be lightweight and easy to use. It has a range of motion that allows it to reach out and grab objects from a distance. The arm is also equipped with a camera that allows the user to see what the arm is doing. The rover is powered by a Raspberry Pi Pico W with Wi-Fi and Meccano wheels. In an exciting DIY adventure, the genius behind Prusa Printers embarked on a mission to create a Raspberry Pi Pico-powered HBO spotter. This nifty gadget can burn designs onto wood and paper, all programmed using Python. Despite the challenges faced alongside university commitments, the creator persisted with their vision. After a few tweaks and redesigns, the spotter's performance improved, and linear rails were added for extra stability. The journey even ventured into crafting a custom PCB using flat CAM and BCNC, overcoming soldering hurdles along the way. With the project files and links shared freely, this inspiring journey showcases the magic that happens when electronics meet creativity. Presenting an engaging DIY journey where a custom digital clock comes to life using a Raspberry Pi Pico and the RDC DS3231, documented in an insightful video. The process involves orchestrating LED strips, specifically WS2811 or 2812B variants, skillfully soldered to the Pico using a soldering iron and 22AWG silicone hookup wire. With meticulous craftsmanship, 3D printer-crafted casing from STL files envelopes the innovation. A distinctive touch emerges as a WS2811-2812B LED strip adorned with two LEDs per segment, with a top panel secured via a hot glue gun and electrical tape. To ensure legible numbers and a soft ambience, a repurposed white cloth from an old t-shirt diffuses light. Notably, the clock boasts various brightness and color settings. Our next project is all about using the Raspberry Pi Pico to show computer stuff on a matrix screen. And guess what? It won't cost much, just around $20. We're using special codes called MicroPython and NeoPixel to make things work smoothly. But here's the catch, these matrix things need more power than the Pico can give from its USB. So, we'll connect them to a 5 volt power thing. Wait, there's more. We're using some computer magic, HTML5 and JavaScript, to take screen stuff and put it on the matrix using a cool trick. Oh, and don't forget the cool part, a case that we'll make using a 3D printer, no fancy stuff needed. So get ready for a project that's easy on the wallet and loads of fun. Thanks for watching, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons.